Tomorrow, though, fans can look forward to some comfort food, a uh, little something to tide us over until the game on Friday. George Webb is going to make promise uh, good on its promise for all of those free burgers. Ricky Mitchell has more on the preparations underway and people willing to wait in line, as only Wisconsinites <laughs> will do, for something free. Ricky. Hey, it's something that we can all look forward to after tonight's game. I think employees, though, are half nervous, half excited for tomorrow at the George Webb on the east side here on Oakland. They told me they have 17 cases of burger patties ready to go and ready to feed some hungry fans. Uh, don't crew! Woo! At Major Goolsby's downtown, this Halloween decoration isn't the only thing spooking Brewers fans. How do you feel about this series so far? Scary. It's scary. And while the games have kept the brew crew on the edge of their seats, tomorrow they'll be standing in line for a free burger. I'm pumped about it for sure. Dan Bush was too young to take advantage of the 1987 giveaway, the last time the Brewers won 12 games in a row. As you can see, I'm, I'm not shy to eat a free burger every now and then. Okay, there's probably going to be some lines. You're prepared for that? Oh, yeah, absolutely. From 2 p.m. to 6 p.m. tomorrow, fans can claim their free burger at any George Webb location. You know, I know it's just a hamburger, but everybody's, you know, it's just that, like a part of history. Celine Kostopoulos says they have extra staff ready to go at the George Webb in Tosa, and employees have been practicing their assembly line skills. A little nervous. I know it's going to be really busy. For fans who can't make it during the giveaway hours, most locations have these vouchers available, good for a free burger through the end of the month. I'm guessing you have school tomorrow. Are you going to go after school? Probably. Okay. You're not worried about long lines? No, I'll wait. <laughs> Now, in 1987, George Webb ended up giving out nearly 170,000 free burgers. One employee that we talked to today said she's actually thinking it's going to be a little bit more this time around because with social media, more people are now aware of the giveaway. Reporting live on the east side, Ricky Mitchell, today's TMJ4. Get your appetite ready. Thanks, Ricky.